<clears throat> hey gamers, welcome back to my gaming channel, Video Gamers Oasis Play Theater. I'm your host, Lumik Geek. Back again with some more Puzzle Plus Challenge of the Warlords Fantasy RPG game. Do we have time for a brief mission? Um, it's a fantasy RPG game with bejeweled gameplay elements. You can uh, go to my website, videogamersoasis.com. Constantly updating the website, but it's uh, it's online now. So you'll, you'll find some interesting information on Puzzle Quest very soon. And um, I'm also developing the mobile compatibility. So you'll be able to eventually see my website on your mobile phone. If you notice here, I've painted my microphone spit guard chrome colored, chrome silver. So I'm pretty proud of that. Recently did that. Let's get on with this mission. We have time for a brief mission. Profession Druid, level 48. 9,763 gold. 49,843 experience. Next level at 52,000. So let's see what's going on. Uh, where can we go for missions? Is there anything at the Horn Temple? Good quests. No quests available. Alright. Um, well, I guess we can go to Duncor. See what's happening there. Maybe something interesting is happening in Duncor. Quests. Incoming. It's a repeat mission. Don't need to do that. Is there anywhere else we can go? What's, what's happening in, in Gruul Dock? Quests. Antidote. Repeat. We don't need that mission either. Uh... What's happening in Bartonia, our hometown? Oh, we have no choice but to fight this ogre. Ogres use their spike clubs to regenerate red mana. They then use that red mana to cast thump and damage their opponents. Stones. 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 Stones.
almost done this mission. Almost done. Stone. Lightning! You're almost done. Victory is mine. You are victorious! 73. You've gained the following 28 gold, 10 experience for your victory. You've also gained 8 gold and 6 experience. Rank 23 in cunning also gives you 5 gold and 4 experience. Continue. What's happening in good old Bartonia? Any missions here? Get quests. Patrol duty. No, don't want to do patrol duty again. So we have to go up all the way back to Tusk. See what's going, what's going on up there. So we did a bunch of meaningless missions, but no, no worries. We'll find a mission. Fight the Minotaur. We have no choice. Fire is your great satellite when you're fighting a Minotaur. You are victorious. victorious! Score. Quadruple zero one. You've gained the following 23 gold, 118 experience for your victory. You've also gained 5 gold, 4 experience. Rank 23 in cutting also gives you 3 gold and 2 experience. Continue. What's happening in Tusk? Tusk, a central gathering place for many tribes of Minotaurs. Tusk was once home to the arena where Sartek staged the Battle of the Kavar. Get quests. 
Okay, here we go. Fourth gear. Now we're getting interesting. You must help Calcus gather the fourth the fourth piece of the great machine. Oh, there is not a piece of the great machine nearby. My detector's going off the scare. I can't believe that. Which way, Calcus? Right. It's out of here. Look to the near and the Minotaur kings are in there. Or so and such, uh, but I bet that he just has a li leave sell us the. Let's go. All right, let's have the Eric's Arena. What's happening here? Battle the Minotaur King. Oh, that must be tough. Minotaur King, as well as the simple ability to deal huge, huge, huge amounts of damage. Minotaur Kings are able to use the Berserk Rage spell to turn red. Gems into skulls. Fires your great shadow when you're fighting a minotaur. Surprise! Say hello to my little friend. <laughs> Skull. Don't let him get the red stones. Spell resisted. Stones.
again. My turn. How about a little bit of lightning? Defeating Eric. Eric, the Minotaur. Victorious. Three three thousand four hundred seventy-seven. You've gained the following: thirty gold, thirty-seven experience for your victory. You've also gained eighty gold and eighty-two experience. Rank twenty-three in cunning also gives you fifty-eight gold and fifty-nine experience. Continue. I can't believe you thought he'd sell us the part. Well, uh, the economics. I was thinking that a minotaur would uh, have caused, would have caused to want such an item as this beautiful, beautiful little metarad rolling and built. What do you think a minotaur would be? Come on, Calcus, let's get back. You must have nearly all of the parts for this machine by now. Quest complete. Fourth gear, you have found the fourth piece of the great machine. You receive the following reward, 250 gold and 250 experience. Done. And on that note, we'll continue on another day. Profession Druid, level 48, 10,253 gold, 50,415 experience. Next level at 52,000. And we'll continue on another day. We're going to just exit from the game. Yes, save the game. Gamers, like to thank you for watching me play Puzzle Blast Challenge of the Warlords Fantasy RPG game with visual gameplay. I hope you enjoyed our little gameplay. We were able to defeat the the uh, Minotaur King Eric, Eric, and obtain the fourth component of the Great Machine for Calgus the Dwarf. I would appreciate it if you would like this video, add it to your favorites, leave comments below, share it with your friends on Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, Google Plus, all those social media websites that you use for your base. Of course, Google Plus, no, no more. So you could sc scratch that off the list, but at least Facebook, Twitter, share that. I'll be most grateful. Reddit, <laughs> any other social media that you use, please share. And don't forget to subscribe to my gaming channel, Video Gamers Oasis Play Theater, and click that notification bell to be notified of the latest videos that I'll be doing. Um, you can like me on Facebook uh, and, and Twitter. I have special, I have a, the business website, uh, Facebook and Twitter for my website uh, and I also have the the YouTube channel Facebook and Twitter so the links are below click those links click them like them follow all that stuff I would appreciate it also if you would help support the work that I do 
by downloading the Brave browser. It's an awesome new browser, um, high-tech, uh, open source, with a lot of cool nifty features to protect you on your web, on your web browsing, on, on the internet, super highway to protect you and your, your loved ones. Uh, so it's great for protection, uh, uh, privacy uh, modes that can prevent you from being spied on by other people. And uh, it also has a internet a digital currency that you can earn for people visiting your website. And you can also help me uh, by downloading the Brave Browser. You actually help um, provide some monetary rewards for my work by uh, providing me some some monetary uh, digital currency through the downloading of the Brave Browser. Links in the description. Thanks for watching, gamers. Stay tuned for more up updates on my website, and stay tuned for more gaming videos on Video Gamers Oasis Play Theater. I'm your host, Sneaky. Thanks for watching. Till next time, be honorable and respectful to one another. Till next time, and recording. The browsers of today are broken. They've been overtaken by a barrage of sneaky and annoying ads. Trackers that follow your habits and cookies that build profiles and all sorts of other internet clutter that's taking precedence over the content that you want to see. In fact, these useless bites can take up to a whopping 50% of page load times, with a third of it anxiously trying to learn more about you. To make matters worse, some ad blockers are even letting ads through when large advertisers pay them. But do you really want a leaky ad blocker? It's because of these very reasons that we developed Brave, a new browser that kicks internet crud to the curb and makes it faster, safer, and better to surf the web than your current browser. With Brave, everything you need is built right in. We integrated technology that automatically blocks trackers, annoying ads, and shields everything that can cramp your style and destruct your privacy. With it, you can expect increased speeds nearly two times faster on laptops and up to four times faster on mobile. And unlike any other browser, Brave allows you to support your favorite publishers with automatic micropayments, so it's a win-win for you and your favorite sites. To top it all off, Brave is open source, because we truly believe it's our web and we need to fix it together. So ask yourself this question, do you want a web browser made for the internet of today? If so, try Brave. It's faster. Safer and ad free. I'm getting stronger step by step. The clock is ticking, but there's no time for me. I've been flying from town to town.